Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here, one trailer at a time today. We're gonna take a look at a 2023 Jayco Bungalow, model number 40, DLFT. It's a double loft, rear living room, park model. Our first chance at seeing one of these. Super excited to show it to you. This is gonna have you dancing like a 1950s gangster. I'm here with my friend, that Dutch bad boy, Brennan Hannemeyer on the camera today. Say hello, Brennan. How's it going, happy campers? Thank you so much for tuning in to the number one RV YouTube channel in the world. We have a like button, we have a subscribe button. We're almost at 5,000. Let's blow past that. I appreciate you hitting that. We're on Instagram, we're on TikTok, and we're on Facebook. Follow us along there also. Comment section's open. Let us know what you think about this park model, or if there's another park model you like better. We kind of have two iterations of this right now in stock, right? And we got the double off bungalow and the double off residence. So if you like this floor plan, but want some tweaks, check out that residence too. Front manual jack, 30 pound of paint tanks, and there's a space in through here for a uh, battery in a box. A lot of these park models have removable tongues. The double off residence or the double off bungalow does not. That stays right on. There's windows here at the front. They just got these boarded up just for um, transport to the park, that kind of thing. So that will stay there and then come off when it gets there. We've got slide toppers on this particular one as an option. We got a window on either side of the bedroom slide, storage underneath it, 10 gallon gas, electric water heater, furnace vent, black water flush kit. Our tires are through here, city water connection, outside shower. And then right here's our kitchen slide. And that sounds just like it is. Pulling the kitchen off the floor, 50 empty tactical style cord, and then a roof ladder. So I want you up on your roof checking your seals every 90 days. Even though it's in a park, it's not moving, it's still really, really important you're doing that. Windows all the way across the back side and then all the way across the front side as well. Skipping down through here, we got our patio door right here, a lend a hand grab handle, and our electric awning is in front of the slide the full length, outside speakers, and then a secondary entrance right into the bedroom here so you don't have to disturb the rest of the people. Let's have a look inside. Right on, folks, we're inside that bungalow double loft. I'm not in jail, we're actually up here in the loft, which is pretty cool. Over, able to overlook the living room there at the back. There's another loft in behind, but we're gonna see that all closely there, but I wanna kinda give you that idea there. Show off that living space while I'm coming down, Brennan. I'll do it up. We got a cool spot for the fridge. Get what them. do fridges do, Brennan? Fridges, fridge, man. They get things cold. <laughs> <laughs> We got our freestanding table and chairs right through here. That's pretty slick. You'll notice there's no carpet here built in the slide. Theater seats across from the uh, the, tape, the TV, which is cool, and then storage here across the top. Now, it depends on, on your site layout, but a lot of times you like to have the windows in the back, and you especially like to have the windows on the door side. We've got ourselves our trifold style sofa here, which also pulls into a secondary bed. We've got tables on either side of this couch with a little bit of storage, receptacles, lights, and then storage for you tall people, Brandon, up across the top there. TV across from the theater seats like we talked about. Built-in fireplace storage here. For you short people. For me, short, for us <laughs> short people like Josh. Radio in through there, DVD player, storage there. Pantry location right in through here. Okay, and I don't want to buzz over this ottoman. This ottoman's an option. Actually, it used to be an option. I think it's a standard now. We'll have to check into that, but this one has that option. We got our seamless countertops here, undermount stainless steel sink, pull out faucet, storage here in the island for garbage can recycling, pots and pans perhaps. And then more counter space here, four more smaller drawers. And when I say smaller, I mean medium size, open storage there, kitchen window, storage, storage, storage. Oversized microwave, not a convection, just a really big microwave. And we do got our four burner stove top with our insignia oven. And then fridges are to keep things cool. Oh, right. Which Brandon was just trying to get out there. But, uh. Fridges, fridge, buddy. Fridge, fridges, that's all I do is a <laughs> fridge. <laughs> Wasn't like a football player called the fridge? There was. Yeah. Uh, that's all I know about him. No, I think he played for the Pittsburgh Steelers. Receptacle there. This is a great spot to park some appliances. Drawers here. Covered space there, and another covered right through here. No uh, central vac, Brandon. In years past, that's kind of where they've stored that, so there's no central vac on this. We got our uh, light switches, slide out switches, awning switch right through there, and into our bathroom. I was really, 
really impressed with this because the problem is there's a loft here above, right? So how do you vent things out of the bathroom? So they've actually got a little cut cubby right here, cut in, trimmed off really nicely, and then there's your vent up and through there. That's a, a really cool thought. Porcelain toilet here. I'm a little tight on the left side, but the dump truck fits. We've got our laundry prep here. Bingo, bango. We got our uh, full shower here. I'm six feet tall. My head's a little bit in the skylight, but I can definitely shower here. There's a seat I can shave my legs. Nice glass storage door or glass shower doors. Medicine cabinet, undermount uh, plastic sink, and then stored right in through there. And then come on out, B. Who would have thought we could do a skylight? When they had a loft above them. That's clever. What is that? How, how does that even work? It's not really a skylight. They just kind of like hollowed out. Right, just to give you more space. Yeah. Okay. No, 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 no skylight actual... that's coming through there. Right, so it's more like a roof, like a, like a roof cut. <laughs> <Cut it. laughs> right. So not a skylight, folks. Don't correct me on that. <laughs> up into the loft, so I'll let Brendan show the left loft. I'll go up to the right one. So that's where I started on that side. Over here, we got the, the, the two lofts right here, or the two beds in the second loft. We got an AC here. We got a spot to put a TV. Great camera work, Brandon. Great work, buddy. How's your back feeling? Must be pretty good, eh? A lot better, man. These push-ups have been helping. Good for you, man. Window here, storage here. Yeah, just a nice little loft. All right, now you're gonna see the, yeah, maybe look it's, somewhere else, Brandon. Ooh, let's that's watch the caboose. Nice. Choo-choo. <laughs> you backing up? <laughs> yeah. Choo choo, that's not how you back up, it's not a train. Well, you're a caboose. Oh, is part I see. Of the train. Back up the caboose. Yeah. Gotcha. Wow. Someone right. didn't watch Thomas this morning. <laughs> <laughs> Storage here at the front. More of that there. Windows across the front, too. They'll be, uh, you know, the boards will be taken off. Window here. Six more drawers here. Big drawers on the bottom layer. Snow White took the seventh one. I know, I'm that <laughs> son of a. Wardrobe space. And I like this piece. See how there's like a space underneath here that's just kick off boots and shoes. That's pretty slick. Nice reading lights above the bed. Storage also across the top. And that a king size bed? Yeah. That's mm. awesome. Yeah, that's yeah. okay. Awesome, folks. That's the video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Hit the like button, the subscribe button. Hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Leave us a comment down below. Have yourself a good day.